Hi, my name is Garrett Allen. I'm 28 years old. I'm from San Diego, California. I'm here at the Summer Circus Spectacular doing my aerial rope act, or cordelisse as it's sometimes called in French. Um, it's just a single rope and I do a variety of twists and turns and different positions, catch and release, different drops, showing off a lot of flexibility and strength. So back in San Diego, I was about 10 years old and I had taught myself how to walk on stilts. My grandpa built me a pair and I found a small local circus school and I started doing it after school and I was learning handstands and tumbling and different kinds of tricks and eventually moved on to aerial. Um, and by the time I turned 18, I was able to do it professionally. I was starting to book little gigs here and there and I just kept with it. I'm 28 now and uh, this is my full-time gig. So, like many other aerial apparatuses, uh, and circus in general, it requires a lot of strength, flexibility, precision, balance. I have a rigorous warm-up and cool-down routine that I do to prevent any kind of injuries. Uh, and with this act in particular, and with rope in particular, uh, I have a lot of skin showing with my costume, and the rope is really abrasive to give me that good grip. So, dealing with a lot of like rope burns and building up of calluses and that kind of stuff, it's also a lot of precision. The rope is just, you know, an inch and a half wide or so, so when I'm doing tricks where I let go and then grab back on again, I have very little margin for error. My advice to anyone looking to become a circus artist would be to just expose yourself to as much art as you can, whether it be music, visual art, dance, or circus itself.